from a full day of looking at shows. There's the Hard Rock Cafe. This is Campus Martius. That used to be Kennedy Square, but now it's a little big building. Chase Tower. There's on the way to Canada. Campus Martius with the grass. Do you know where you're going, Hard Mr. Rock Cafe? He doesn't know where he's going. We know where we're going. There's the main county building. Uh, here's the Albert Kahn Design Theater. And we're going into Greek Town. Approaching right turn on Bedry End Street, followed by a left turn. Shut up, GPS. This is Greek Town. And I had to keep pinching myself. I thought today was Saturday. Today's Wednesday. Old Shillelagh. Fun place to be on St. Patrick's Day. Oh, bumpy bumpy fish bones. Second Baptist Church. Historic Church Underground Railroad Station. Sports memorabilia. The Greek Town Casino. Here's Greek Town. One of the ethnic neighborhoods that we're known for. Now it's got the casino. Lycon, Cyprus. This used to be the Hellas where I got my lamb chops. It's going to open up as another restaurant. This is plaque. We put a lot of green plaques on stuff. So they're historic. St. Mary's Parish. This is the Greek town hotel and parking structure. An interesting thing about this part of town, there are lots of churches around here that just across this freeway is another historic neighborhood. Here's the portion of the Renaissance Center purchased by GM, which is GM headquarters, along with there's the Marriott Hotel, and that's me. And the Greek Town Casino through there. We'll go off this year. can't see it too well now it's getting a little dark but um, that high rise is 1300 Lafayette and in amongst that landscaping over there is the Lafayette Park neighborhood which is made up of a number of townhouses garden homes and High rises, all designed by Mies van der Rohe. Landscaping is a big part of it because the maybe when we go by, we can see some of them. But it's a great place to live because you're within walking distance of um, Greek town restaurants, casino. See some of those. This place is huge too. But this whole area downtown was at once called Black Bottom. And in the late, mid late 50s, 60s, it 
it was urban renewaled. Oh, down here is the. It's a green field now. People can jog and ride their bikes. But we were. It was urban renewaled and rebuilt up into. housing situations where the makeup was high income, low income, middle income. Everybody lives together. One big happy family. These are the Martin Luther King apartments. They're low income. And uh, I forgot what those are called. Square. Town Square. That's more middle to high income. And then there's where on your city side, that's good. And there's where we live. Oh, this is old folks right here. And then where we live, which is called Ralph Bunch Co-op. And it's uh Everybody, it's a nice place to live because, again, it's near downtown. We have our own park. That's it. And when uh, Fourth of July comes, we have the fireworks, Freedom Festival between Detroit and Canada. It's always a lot of fun. We can go to our park and see it. Well, I'm home now. I'm going to upload my videos. Goodbye.